Que pasa? So, welcome to my second uh, Black Clover mobile video. Um, yeah, the, the, the Japanese servers have opened, what, 20 minutes ago? And I thought I might make a quick video regarding the re-rolling system. I mean, there is already a bit of content out regarding how to re-roll and stuff like that. But I thought I might as well just do it again for my viewers. So, yeah, that's got to be covered as well. So, the re-rolling system in this game is actually pretty sick. Um, you have, like, once you finish the initial tutorial, you have the option of doing 20 summons. So, down below, right here, it says um, it says 8 of 20. So, I already did 8 re-rolls, or, or basically 8 summons from 20, right? And from those 20... You can always save your most favorite, um, your most favorite pull sort of at this section right here. So the one I saved was the one where I got Lotus, which is presumably currently um, the one you should be going for the most, right? So that's basically the character you want to get. But I do want to keep going all of those twenty summons in order to see if I'm able to pull maybe like two SSRs in one, so SSR is the highest rarity you can get from this, and this is also the guaranteed SSR, so every summon will guarantee you an SSR character, right? So Lotus is going to be the one you want to be getting, even though I don't really feel his design. I'm going to be all honest about it, like, I don't really like his design right there, but that's just personal opinion. Um, nevertheless, doesn't change the fact that he's, um, in terms of skill and gameplay, probably the best. Again, I haven't checked it on anything, so it's going to be a first for me. So, let's continue with the summons. Let's see if we are able to get maybe um, two SSRs in one. Maybe a crazy Lotus summon with Lotus and his skill card as well. That would be awesome. So, that's how the animation looks. I'm going to be skipping it. I can't, I can't be actually bothered to, um, to keep it going. So, let's see. What do we got right there? Oh, I don't even know what his name is, but okay. That's another one we got. Alright, that's the ninth one. Um, that is not a summon I would want to save, so I'm going to keep going. I don't even know if it's possible to get two SSRs. That's another thing. I've heard of people getting one SSR and one skill card. SSR, that's, that's probably possible. But getting two SSR characters is probably not going to be possible in this one. But regardless, we're going to keep going all of those 20. I saved the Lotus one. So at least I got already what I want. So let's keep going. What else can we get from this? But by the way, this is a great, great rerolling system. I really love the fact that they're basically enabling you, hey... You can do 20 summons for free. Choose which ones of those 20 summons you like the most. And that's what you gain. Like, I mean, if Bleach Brave Souls had a re-rolling system like this for newer players out there, that would be insane, right? That would be literally insane. Ah, right. Okay. He looks sick. I like his design. But no, it's something which I want to keep. Let's continue. All right. So let's see what this is going to be. So far, I've only had one summon where I pulled Lotus, right? So, kind of weird. Ah, Leo. Right, he's supposed to be very good as well, but I'm not going to be taking him. Let's continue on. In case you want to see the summons without the skip, that's how it looks. It's basically that mage dude in the beginning, and he's allocating, or basically uh, finding uh, the Grimoires. Let's see what this is going to be. Ah, okay. Another one of this guy. I don't even know what his name is. Um, and I can't use a translating app while I'm recording. Um, otherwise, the recording will stop. So, yeah. That's just one of the gimmicks using a translating app when playing such games on Android. Anyways, let's keep it going. Let's see what we got. Ah, right. Him again. Nope, not something I want. Five summons left, bro. 
I actually got once Lotus only in 20 summons, so in 15 summons so far. Crazy, actually. Most of the other characters I've actually had more than twice now. All right, it's the third time I'm pulling her. Okay, 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 okay. I have an SSR, two SSRs. Right. But unfortunately, not the character at all I want. And yeah, I can't translate this now. But I will be making detailed videos with uh, where I translate every single menu in the game and uh, translate all the character skills. So bear with me on that one. Okay, that's that's another one out there. But I'm going to be skipping it. I'm not going to be saving that because, again, I saved the Lotus one. And I do want to keep that one. And I want to start the game with Lotus if he's supposed to be the best character right now. To choose from this, then I definitely want to start with him. Right. Three more summons left. Let's go. Okay, where is this going to be? Another Lotus? With an SSR skill card, possibly? Nope. Unfortunately not. Okay, wasn't too bad, actually. I mean, I did have that one multi where I got two SSRs. I mean, one SSR character and one skill card, which is actually nice. So, let's carry on. Oh, yeah, it's him again. Forgot his name. He's supposed to be a good character as well, though. Right, the last one. Let's see what we get in. Let's see what we get in. Skipping out. It could be like it can't be. It can't be for real that I only had one Lotus in twenty summons. Like that is crazy. All right. Okay. Okay. So it's it's officially a uh, done deal now. I'm gonna be summoning. Uh, choosing my saved Lotus and yeah that's basically how the re-rolling system works in this game um, again the suggestion seems to go more towards Lotus so I will be covering his gameplay and making a full review video regarding his skills and why he's supposed to be as good as he's been uh, proclaimed um, yeah thanks for watching and stay tuned for more Black Clover mobile content